These are Frontenac grapes. They're developed um, from a uh, strain up in Minnesota. They're meant to, uh, they wake up real late in the spring and then they put on their fruit and they're done real early in the fall. And this year it was a real good deal because my cherry trees over there, they woke up way too early. Blossomed out, bees showed up, did their thing, and then right after that it got zapped by 20 degree weather and frost and uh, now I don't have, I'm not going to have um, cherries this year. There are, uh, by this time, those trees should be, you should be seeing a whole bunch of red on there. But, trees are still alive, so I'm happy with that. Um, these grapes, they got, they got whacked at the same time. And I had, uh, I had my doubts about them. I came out, came out and picked a whole bunch of uh, uh, brown, shriveled up uh, shoots off of these, and um, just let them go uh, because you know that's the only thing that you could can do. You're, it's either going to happen or it's not, and it looks like this year it's going to happen. I expect, from what I'm seeing here, I'm expecting to see probably seven or eight gallons of grapes. These are, uh, um, they're a lighter color than, than Concords, but they're still, they're still considered a red grape. I've got one more, one more 